Hi, this is J2 here. On this video, I'll be showing you how to fix your user profile on Windows 7 so it can be loaded. This right here, it is the login screen. And whenever you click on your profile, this error will pop up saying that the user profile service service failed to log on. The user profile cannot be loaded. And the reason it cannot be loaded because there's the error on your profile account. And then there's many ways to do this. You can either delete the error ID and create a new profile. You could copy the data to a new account or fix the user account profile. And then to do that, I will have to go to the safe mode to actually get into the computer to actually fix it. So what I'm going to do is restart the computers. And then I'm going to be hitting F8 to get this screen up and then go to safe mode. And right now it is in safe mode. Okay, so I'm going to go to start and in search, I'm going to type in R-E-G-E-D-I-T for registry editor. And the registry editor will not pop out. And what I will want to go is will be the hockey local machine and then software. And then scroll down to Microsoft. And then scroll down to Windows NT. Right here, window NT, and then current version. And then what I want is the profile list. So I'm gonna scroll down till I find profile list right there. And then as you can see, the S1518, the, the first three right here will be the SID right there. And what you wanna look for is the one with the SID with the longest number, like these three right here. And then what you want to do is look for um, the one with your profile in it. So the profile will be in profile image path. So I'm going to be click on this. Yep, and that's my username for the profile. So it's, it ended .bak. So what I want to do is rename this one. Let me rename it. Okay, I'm going to name it .ba. Then go back to the one that said .bak right there. And then I'm gonna rename that. And I'm just gonna remove the .bak and go back to the top one right here where I named BA. I'm gonna rename it again. Oops. And I'm gonna name it .bak. Then we'll go back to this right here where I deleted the .bak and then I'm going to go to um, the state and hit modify and I'm going to change the 8000 right there to 0 and then I'm going to go to ref count right click modify and change that to 0 okay and after that I'm just going to close this and then restart the computers And as you can see, the loading error, it is no more. And it can actually load into my account now. 